Hello, RT aliens, and welcome. I am Paul Yateman. I draw stuff. For the month of May, that involves drawing stuff in a Tim Burton inspired style. Today, I am drawing a couple of creatures I first drew way back in 2011. One is a beaver like sort of alien, and the other one is more or less an octopus. I seem to have a penchant for drawing things with tentacles and things with more than the standard two eyes and big wide open mouths. So that's what we get today. Two of those things. As per most of my drawings of late, I start with a blue pencil and sketch things out. Uh, today's sketch took about three minutes, which is really quick and nasty. Following the blue pencil sketch, I grab my 0.8 highlighter. Sorry, not my 0.8 highlighter, my 0.8 fine liner, and applied ink to both of the drawings. And I also indicated shadows by thickening up some of the line weight when I did that. And following the inking of this drawing, what I did was I scanned it in and then I applied Copic marker, going for a grey themed look and then trying to include other colours which would give the pictures hopefully a not too flat but still interesting look with the sort of Tim Burton style. Not sure I achieved that very well today but I am happy with the two characters which I managed to produce so that's a win. And for today's drawing I started with the greys and I used them to indicate just the shadow areas and then once the shadows were down then I added some colour. Fairly messy but that's the style we're going for. And then following the colour I added some more shadow in the way of some more greys and I also improved the colours of the stripes on the octopus because I felt they were a bit washed out. And I think the last thing I did was indicated a, a lot more fur than we can see on the first sketch of the beaver thing with the multiple ears on top of its head. Just to give it a fur coat sort of look and to see if that would actually work with markers. And I think it worked okay, so that's all great. So here's the line art along with the inspiration image. And here it is after colouring in a little bit of Photoshop and here it is chopped out of the background. So yeah, if you found this interesting, informative, entertaining, you were inspired to draw in your own sketchbook and all that crazy stuff, subscribe, like and share. Until next time, you have been watching Drawing Self with me, Paul Yateman. Ciao, take care and as always, happy drawing.